Hello everyone, this is Moses from Zothar Gardens. I'm in Central California, Zone 9B. Uh, this is a cherimoya. I had a El Bumpo cherimoya here uh, with that heavy rains that California got. It, um, and the, the, the frost, it, 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 uh, it died all the way to the rootstock. The rootstock was still growing but I don't know what type of variety that was, so I took that out and I planted this Chaffee Cherimoya. I've had Chaffee before and it's excellent. Uh, and Chaffee is the fastest growing variety, one of the fastest. It is the hardiest variety, cold hardiest. Um, one other, and produces, and it's almost self-pollinating or it can become self-pollinating. I do know of one other person that has a Chaffee Cherimoya and uh, they did extremely, extremely well here in Central California. So if you worry about the frost and growing cherimoyas, you can grow it here. This went through a frost, newly planted, and a couple frost of uh, 30 degrees, 20, no, 30 degrees, not in the 20s, 30 degrees. Nothing happened to it. It didn't even defoliate. Usually in California, they, uh, they lose their leaves for about one month. <clears throat> when it's between winter and spring but uh this video is to show you that we're not even in april and it's already growing if i can make it zoom it's already growing new buds throughout even oh wow i didn't even notice this one that's awesome this is definitely a hardier variety than the el bumpo um, so I have one right here as well. This is what they they look like. Uh, another day, he'll be ready. Awesome looking fruit. It looks like a, I think they call it a dragon's egg. It looks like a, somebody pushed their thumb thumb imprints all over it. Thumb thumb thumb. Seven to ten dollars a pound. Right here. Pretty cool. Easily grown by seeds as well. You have to wait till it's com almost completely brown, then it's ready to go. Alright, guys. I love this tree. Alright, happy gardening. Bye.